What's going on, Internet? This is uh, Matt from the Pints and Pinball Podcast. Since we uh, can't do a lot of uh, podcasting these days, I thought um, we would start uh, doing some videos of what's been going on. Um, I was going to give you all a little tour of all of the crazy uh, half-done messes that I've created here. Um, and then, uh, you know, that way you kind of have your bearings as I'm posting other stuff in the future. Uh, I'm gonna start with this Dracula. This is like basically the last project I worked on uh, for a friend. Um, put some spots in here. I actually did a whole play field tear down, polished and cleaned everything, did a whole LED job on it, rebuilt all the pop bumpers, rebuilt the flippers. This is gonna go on, probably gonna go on location at a local place. Um, but put, yeah, put some spots in here, just brighten it up a little bit. Um, but it looks great. So, uh, I've got a couple of other things I'm doing here. Got the, uh, the powder coating oven project going. Got this barbecue heating element. And, uh, and this is an old footlocker. I'm going to basically stand this up and, and, uh, hopefully insulate it and have some kind of a powder coating rig set up. And we've got the door thing in progress here. I'll probably be posting some videos about that. Um, Gotta have the beer fridge. It's pints and pinball, right? So you gotta have, you gotta have something uh, on hand. Um, you know, even if it's a truly, I mean, those are okay. But you know, I'm gonna try this uh, Oscar Blues Hazy. Hazy. <laughs> I'll go inside and show you the messes I've created downstairs. This is Kit. Lots of people like to show off their fancy collections. Uh, we don't have anything like that here. We're, we got we got projects and messes and things half done. There. So first, got the Model S ski ball. This is fun. Kids love this during the uh, pandemic. Got my memorable or uh, my my memorable event of the big Lebowski cabinet dropping. The pin backpacker Chris will have to fill you in on that one. I think it's on, on one of our episodes. Got the, uh, the Jungle Lord on its back here. This is a league game that I'm going to be doing a repair video on for a fuse clip holder in the near future. Uh, this is a recent find. I love these System 80s right now. So I got this Panthera in pieces it actually i can make it work but it needs uh needs new connectors probably shoot a video on that um you know normal stuff um gosh what else did i do to this uh had a little fuse hiccup i should i should that would be a good little podcast thing uh spent probably about uh three hours troubleshooting something turned out to be two fuses Zero fuse, that's me. All right, let's go to the workshop. See what kind of mysteries we can find in here. Oh, what a mess. What a mess. So here I got my spray booth that needs to go up uh, over there somewhere so I can get to the sanding and uh, all on the black hole project. Um, got uh, this Allied's Rock On. These are both league games giveaway games uh so if we ever get to play in league again i have to get these up and running and uh they'll be the giveaway games in the league and then the system 80 black hole black hole oh, gosh i've owned this game five times and none of them i've bought have ever been as good as the first one i bought this one actually runs right now um it didn't initially but it runs right now and uh i'm working on something Kind of special with this one but uh you'll have to stay tuned in to figure out what we're doing there stay posted but i'm working with some really talented people to do some really cool stuff so um all right so let's see the mess of the workshop um i got my deep sink uh this is like my operator my operator shelving unit hold on so got my Arcade power supplies, 
Got some cool giveaway stuff. Got my bill, bill uh, stackers, my token max. Uh, I've got tons of these uh, dollar bill validators laying around, cup holders and stuff. It's a bunch of spooky prizes. Those guys are awesome. They sent us a bunch of prizes to give away. Whole bag of tote. You guys want to go to Chuck E. Cheese? They bankrupt, I think. We would have some fun. <laughs> All right. That's the operator bin, operator shelf. Got my metal polishing and working station here. So we got the grinder, the uh, vibrating tumbler, and my, my uh, polishing wheel. And this is just the, uh, usually the disassembly table, but right now it's the organizing table. So I got some parts bins. Uh, and I'm trying to do some organization into. Eventually, hopefully all this stuff will get put in its right place and onto these shelves here. So uh, I just got smattering of parts and things game specific parts rubbers pop bumper stuff flipper assemblies lots of ballet stuff it's hard to find leds assorted try to keep them organized into colors and stuff got my sanding stuff my acrylic painting stuff staple guns nailers all these different cards and things that go to the play cards these are hard to find these inline drops paragon i think inline drops whew, super hard to find Glad to have that one. Um, let's see. I have an LED OCD board just laying around, right? Herg makes these. They're pretty badass. Everybody needs those. Just my heavy heavy tools shelf, welding, saws, drills, everything. Regular toolbox with all the screwdrivers and hex drivers and uh, wrenches and normal stuff you would normally find. And then the workbench area. This is my favorite tool right here, the vise. Vise and the drill press are probably the things that get the most attention. Um, that and the, the metal polishing wheel and, and the rotisserie, I guess. Uh, Try to make this kind of a soldering workstation area. So I've got my, my, board, uh, my board holder, soldering iron, desoldering iron, my makeshift magnifying glass stuff. Um, <laughs> I actually have a video in progress that's... Uh, Stealing the metal from this old Adams Family swamp mech. Don't worry, it was busted to begin with. Um, and and Manus, I think, makes them anyway. So, got my guitar amp, just in case I want to jam out while I'm down here. As long as the kids aren't sleeping. Oh, crap, I left my beer somewhere. Did you guys see where I left that? <laughs> here we go. Anyway, so this is the shop. So, uh, when we shoot, when I shoot some videos of, uh, things going on down here you kind of have an idea of what uh what the place looks like it's a total mess not your normal cribs video but uh hope you guys tune in and uh and check some of those out when i post them so listen to pints and pinball if you haven't there's probably about eight nine episodes the last three are the best talk to you soon